Glenmorangie was founded in 1843. The Glenmorangie Empire stands on a stretch of land in the northern highland region of Scotland. The site for mostly illicit alcohol production in the Middle Ages, followed by a colossal legacy nowadays. The production capacity of the distillery stands at 6 million liters, and the water used in the production is drawn for the Tarlogie Springs. The production is supported by an enormous mash ton, which can hold up to 12 tons. Production got off to a successful start, and in 1887, the Glenmorangie Distillery Company Limited was founded. In 1880, exportation began at the distillery and proved to be successful. In 1918, 40% of the distillery was sold to its largest customer, McDonald and Muir and 60% was sold to Dorham, a whiskey dealing company. Production continues successfully under this new management. Due to the great pressure put on the whiskey industry by the Financial Depression and American Prohibition Act in 1931, the distillery was forced to close. After being closed for five years, the distillery was reopened in 1936 and production resumed immediately. In 2004, the McDonald family decided to sell Glenmorangie. The bidding war over the company was absolutely frantic, but at the end, Moet Hennessy emerged triumphantly, and he got to work right away, launching a campaign to remaster the Glenmorangie brand, discontinuing the 15 and 30 year old bottlings while renaming the others. Under Moet Hennessy, Glenmorangie has continued its successful run without undermining the quality of the single malt. Want to know more? Make sure to hit the subscribe button for upcoming videos and don't forget to check out our website.